Hello, welcome to part one of my playthrough of Humankind. Uh, this is going to be my like my third game of this um, playing through it. I got a new headset, a new microphone. My voice is going to sound a lot better. So I wanted to start a new game. This is going to be played on a huge Earth map. So it should be quite interesting. Okay. I'd like to dedicate this series to... Tea time again. Yeah, tea time again. She's a real wonderful person, and uh, she'll be watching along here. And I'm glad she'll be able to, uh, you know, listen to a clear voice, and uh, hopefully uh, we survive enough to get to the uh, contemporary era where I want to buy my tanks and start rolling over people. But uh, we'll see if we can get to that point. Uh, I know in the meantime, the game should have some patches uh, because we have a lot of bugs in this game. There's been, uh, I've been on the, I had a previous game where I got to turn 187 or 807 and the game froze, didn't go to turn 808. So uh, I tried everything. I tried earlier saves. Uh, I tried to do something different on my turn. To see if I might turn out different on for the next turn, but that didn't work. So I don't know. But we're gonna start here anyway. And we start with a uh, group of people called a tribe. Actually, this is called a hunting party. I guess this is a tribe. The hunting party could be up to four tribes. Okay. But this is the new, the Neolithic era, or the new Stone Age. And we're going to go around here. we got some mountains next to us right now here. So I think I'll come down the river here. Yeah. We'll do that. Come down the river again. See if we can find some curiosities, which you'll see what they are in a minute. Here's one right here. This is what's called a curiosity. It's a discovery that can be made. Um, they'll give, it'll give you uh, up here where my pointer is, is influence. Uh, you can get gold later on and food. And food will go here. It'll take 30 food to get another tribe in my hunting party. And then I can take them and, and split them off to go in different directions to... You know, just to be able to discover more land at once. So, let's get this Full discovery. And healthy children. I so, this one gave us five doing. food. So, we got to need 25 more. I'll be reading through the events, too. In this playthrough, the events will be... I'll be reading through them. Um, because I think it's gets people more involved in it and it's more interesting. I mean, you usually could uh, rewind the video and read them yourself, but uh, I, I don't mind reading them. So we end turn there. Onwards. Yeah, we end turn here. Okay. Okay, there we go. Looks like we got ourselves in some kind of peninsula. I don't know what's going on here. We'll just keep going. Let's go down here. We'll go along here and along this coast. I could go back up and go this way. Like you see this spot here is four. Might be good for a city right here. Okay, we'll go this way though. Go this way. Okay, end turn. World deed accomplished that give us 50 fame. You uh, first discovered Gonang Mulu. It's a natural wonder. And here we go. I gave us 10 food, so we need. We got half of our new tribe. Acknowledge. 
Ooh, Ha Long Bay. Another 50 fame, so that's good. Ha Long Bay in here. Wow, this is Ha Long Bay. Ha Long Bay there, too. Okay, we'll go up here. Whoop. We'll end turn. Then we'll go up here to this discovery. Even those who have disappeared may have done something very clever. Now this little first spot has a nice river for our first city. If we want that. We got a resource down here. So we can connect this territory later through an outpost. I'm just thinking outside the box right well i'm just thinking that with what i see so far that would be our best choice but we have ways to go here and turn and from another more river up here this waterfall here Hey, there's a deer. Brr. We probably could defeat it, but I'm not going to weaken myself just in case. Let's wait here. Oh, here's a... Uh... Okay. Seed of an idea. Yesterday, the tribe came across a vast tract of wild grain. The stalk swaying in the breeze like wind playing over golden waters. The ground down grain could feed the tribe twice over. But one of the tribal elders had another, had another idea. Instead of pounding the seeds into flour, she should just planting half of them so the grasses may return next summer. It is a curious idea at odds with nomadic life, but perhaps a harbinger of the future. What should you do? We can plant, or we can grind. We can plant seeds. We must begin to harness the natural rhythms of the world to seek a better life. We get minus 25% on domestication research costs. Or we can grind an automatic tribe plus two food on city or outpost. I think I'm going to grind in this one. I've kind of switched back and forth. I think I'll grind in this one and get the plus two food. I think that's important early on. Now, while I'm waiting for this deer to move, we're going to go in that direction. Here he goes. I'm going to go... Ah, another one came over. Let's go over here a minute. We'll come back. We'll hunt some of these animals down later. They're good for food, of course, obviously. Or gold, one or the other. I think after the h and air, after you hunt, it's the gold they give you. And turn. Okay, he moves so we can get the curiosity now. Wild berries. Order from Mount Vesuvius. Mm. Got an incense silk. That's nice. Silk is nice for industry, of course. All right. Go this way. This way. And that way, in turn. Onwards. And we got uh, another discovery and a mammoth coming. Plus 15 food, so we got another tribe. So we're going to do... We could kill the mammoth with two tribes. 22 to 13, but I don't want to know if I want to do that. Uh, right now. We got five on a third tribe. So we're going to do transfer. And Onward. send this one back here. We're going to go over this way up here. Send that tribe this way, this tribe this way. Go 
Got a deer is blocking my path up that river. So we'll go this way. We got a layer of curiosity over here. I think I'm gonna go this way. Okay, a world of flame. In the distance, a thin quarter smoke cuts up into the clear blue skies. Fire! Calling a few tribes when you run close to the smell of cindered bark and burning pine grows stronger with each footfall. Your spy dancing, you spy dancing flames and suddenly find yourselves on the edge of a settlement on fire. Many of the structures are ablaze, but even with the smoke and flames, you can see these abodes are marvels of craftsmanship. You are about to just you are about to direct your men to put out the fires with loose soil when you see short, shadowy figures running away. Youths. They could become part of your tribe if you give chase now. That would be mean losing the secrets of construction. What is your desire? So you can either chase them to get an extra tribe, which I'm going to do, or extinguish the fire get minus 25% on city defense research cost. I'll go chase and confirm. That'll give us another tribe. Now, I was thinking of going this way with one tribe. So let's do that. And I think if I get a fourth one, I'm going to start hunting animals. And you guys can go up here. Another unknown resource. Resource. Okay, and turn. Yes. Okay. This way. I see. Okay, we got some influence that time. Now, what we can do with this tribe is you can do what's called ransacking. And you just left click your mouse on the highlighted uh, hex. And you'll see here it'll take one turn to ransack. And it'll be for 20 food, so that's good. We move. I'll send you this way. Mm -hmm. uh, another 15 food. Well, it buries another five food. We got a lot of mountains here. A lot of high, eleva high elevation, so... Should be quite defensive for our cities. Ransack successful. Acknowledge. What's over there? This way. Got a deer there. What's over there? My feet hurt. And one guy's feet hurt. You don't have good shoes. I don't think they've. They haven't invented a comfortable shoe. That'll be not for quite a while, so. Uh -huh. Yeah. There we go. Could go this way. Maybe I will go this way. I don't know. Yeah, we'll... I think we're getting too close to the other way. I want to kind of keep it spread out if I can. Okay. I'd like to find some copper, iron, or something like that. What's over there? My feet. This way. Ah, found some copper. All right. My feet. And another. What's over there? Is this a coast here? Look at this, it's beautiful, huh? I love the artwork. Let's just 
discovery. Wild berries, five food. We'll go up here, and there's another one. Just some peaks. Guess we'll go up here. What's over there? This way. Getting kind of boxed in here. Okay, go up here. What have we got here? Another discovery? Okay. Okay, 15 food. And we just got two. So if I get... I got a lair up here. I want to get this taken care of. I want to ransack that lair. Right. We'll do that. These are just mountains up here, so... I'll send you across to discovery here. What's over there? Okay, so we got some more influence. Okay. Turn. And we got T, which is a nice uh Luxury to have. Good for stability and good for food per turn, of course. All right. We have another uh, Lost Souls. Your scout comes to you breathless from exertion. Between gasps, he tells you that he spied another tribe not far ahead. He leads you on, and after giving a stop signal, you drop to your bellies and crawl forward in the brush. Ahead, a young woman no more than 13 summers is leading a ceremony. Her audience, a dozen or so equally young or younger tribesmen. Many are crying when they see you. The bodies laid out to you understand they are in mourning. You know what you must do. You can welcome them and withdraw. They could be sick or cursed. We'll make haste from this place. Swift on two targets for seven turns. We're going to get out of here. They're probably sick. And that's kind of mean, but yeah. That's how we thought back then. So. Curiosity. And turn. We move. Okay, we got 20, 10 more food. We're up to 20 influence. There's another one. Another curiosity. It's tight quarters up here. This way. There's a path through the mountains. Oh, I see. There is a path up here through the mountains. We'll get up. We'll get up there. We'll do that. I guess I can't cross from here. There's. To, well, I could cross over here, but the elephant was in the way. The mammoth. So we're backtracking again, which I don't like. But that's fine. We got this. A harvest of 15. I'd love to get five more. Kill some mammoths. Okay, we're going to come down and try to get this one.
Okay. I'm gonna get to that lair. There's a sanctuary here. You can ransack. Yeah. Will do. Okay, we got more science and more uh, um, influence. So, okay. This way. Trying to pick a good place for a city, but we got a lot of mountains here, so it's going to be compact cities. I'll tell you. Yeah. Okay, a tribe's legacy. You stand at a crossroads for many moons. The tribe has tracked the wilderness slowly and torturously, learning the secrets of this world. How the materials hidden in the deep places and in plain sight might be fashioned to the tribe's advantage. How the beast plants of and plants of the lands and seas can be most fruitfully, fruitfully harvested. And how myths and stories can glacially but inescapably give power over our greatest enemies, other tribes. Now you must decide in what domain the tribe will truly sharpen its knowledge for the ages to come. Will you be renowned as makers, farmers, or charmers? Now, I was thinking of makers um, because we got to have a lot of mountains here, and we'll probably have a lot of industry. So I was thinking of makers for this one. You could de deal with science or food, but I think I'm going to be maker. All right. The one interesting thing is, even though we have a lot of mountains, it seems we have a lot of rivers, too, so that's good. All right, in turn, see if some of these mammoths move. You got a bear here, too. Oh, he's attacking me. I'm going to have to fight him. Manual battle. This will be our first battle. All right, where is he? Land deployment. Roar. He's a big one. We need Davy Crockett here. And rounds. Kill them. Oh, we got him. This guy can't do anything, I don't think, so we're just going to end around. Come after me, we should kill him. There we go, we got him. So someone's got a nice pelt. We move. Go down here. Fifteen more food. Pretty soon we'll have four in that tribe. Porcelain, another uh, resource. It's just nice to have now porcelain. It's good for money, of course, obviously. That, that makes sense. Okay. We have another curiosity over here. I don't know if we can get to it or not. And an unknown resource. Do it. Uh, we're getting close to uh, our first era here. Hunted Hadar. Hunted Hadar. We move this way. There's some tea, we saw that before. And coppers around here. Well, this territory with the tea and copper and this unknown resource. This could be our main one. Our, we could make our first city here. We will have the copper for spearmen. I think I think they give you spearmen. Onward. 
One of the curiosity, okay. And turn. I'll be making these parts a little bit smaller in this one. I figure 36 minutes or 40 minutes. Maybe I'll go, maybe I'll go a little longer. We'll see. Maybe I'll go a little longer. We'll see. But uh, we don't want to fight this uh, mammoth. Not with one. Aerostar unlocked. We've got another resource over here. Now this is where we can choose. See, there's one thing they need to make a uh, change in this game. Is where some of the other... Some of the other... Uh, some of these other guys take different... Uh, make different choices. When we're in Southeast Asia, the Zhao might be a good idea. Plus two stability on district. That's for the whole game. Plus one science, plus five science per adjacent mountain. Plus one research for slot and city or outpost. I think I might take these. And then we'll need horses and copper if we're going to get this... Uh, Zanshe, Zansh, whatever it's called here. It's a uh, horse-toed vehicle. It's kind of like a ch Chinese chariot. Okay. Or there's the Phoenicians where we could do the ship thing, which might be nice too, but uh, there's probably a lot of small islands that are interesting around here. There's the Hittites that have the Giger, which is another chariot. It's a war chariot. We still need horses. I haven't seen any horses. The Babylonians, which can give us this, which is interesting with their copper. Plus 10 stability, astronomy house, plus 10, minus 10 stability, plus 3 science per adjacent farmer's quarter, or city or outpost, plus 1 food per researchers, plus 1 science per researchers. Or the Assyrians, which have a uh, Assyrian raider, which also needs a horse. So if we want a special unit, we're going to have to pick the uh, Babylonians. But since we have a lot of mountains, I think we're going to pick the Zhao. Yeah. I think we're going to pick the Zhao. I, I, I have a feeling that that's going to help us a lot. And the stability on districts is going to help us too. So I think we'll adopt the Zhao. We'll see if we can find some horses around. And maybe we can make this unit here. There's heavy cavalry. But if not, we'll rely on our spearmen. That's the best unit I think we can get. So we'll adopt these guys. And he's got the Chinese armor. That's cool. Confirm. He's the whitest Chinese guy I've ever seen, but that's okay. Okay, we have two over here now, two tribesmen. What we need to do... I'm trying to think of... Obviously, we'd like an outpost here. We've got some food places here. We've got um, when we get this inside our city, we got three mountains, which is going to give us some science. So I think I want to have my first. What I'm going to do is this. I'm going to split this unit up and have him go further. I'm going to transfer. Uh -huh. Okay, and then I'm going to have him come back. We move. Yeah, I'm going to have him come back and build an outpost. Uh, it should build fast. I, I don't know. Let's see. 614. Yeah. We're not going to have much food uh, if we go there. 12, 9. 12, 10. 
nine thirteen. How about twelve ten? Yeah. We'll do that. Twelve ten is a good mixture. It's twenty two. Okay. We have some new company. What's over there? We got forty five influence now. What a desert up here. Sterile terrain. Um, we will ransack this. Left click. Okay, we'll keep going with you. Keeping up with the neighbors when they have the wheel and you don't. Humankind learns quickly that everyone contributes. If you're terrified of wild animals, you can grow lentils or catch fish. Tribes settle towns. Towns develop markets, and markets begin the exchange of goods, services, and most important rumors and hearsay. Perhaps you don't really need to focus on markets when you have deep philosophers. And dangerous chariots. If we can get them. I haven't seen any horses. And that's the problem with this game. They want like. Some units they want three horses. And two copper. And I'm lucky I found one copper. Oh there's another copper here. What am I saying? <laughs> you still need some horses. And we got some. A stone field with salt. So that's nice. So this is a nice area too. I might have to get the two coppers. Oops. Okay. Mm -hmm. Off we go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Over this way. I could destroy these units. Um, sanctuary, we're gonna ransack that. Left click. I'll take a turn. And turn, okay. Cultural chosen. A first ransack. See the sites, appreciate the local culture, and take anything that's not nailed down. Sounds good to me. Ten gold. Another porcelain. We need to make uh, all these guys. Let's see if there's anything down here. Come over here.
It's about a desert. Okay. Okay, where's our exact hex? So I remember where it is. It's between two mountains here. That's where we're building our outposts. I'm going to attack... Uh, I'm not going to attack this deer, no. We'll skip our turn. See if he gets out of my way. Okay. It's holding us up, though. We need to get that outpost going. It's annoying us. They have a certain appeal, the Olmecs. Be careful that your people don't start liking the neighbors more than you. You know, we gotta watch out for the Olmecs because they can take territory. We can fight them. I'm on it. But I don't know if I want to fight them, but I got horses. Silly, aren't they? History may be changed by battles, but that doesn't mean they're enjoyable. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna retreat. But we found some horses, guys. So we're gonna have to fight an. We're gonna have to get. I want those horses. <laughs> I'm a bad guy. No, I'm a good guy. I just want the horses. Let's meet this guy, though. See what this he says. This is where I greet you, impress upon you the wonder of my people, and tell you my ambitions. No? Maybe. <laughs> okay. What do we say in return? Surprise war, proposed alliance, trade. I don't have any resources yet, so we're not going to bother. We're just, we'll just meet them. But this is his place, San Lorenzo. He has the horses. He doesn't have the horses. Okay. We're going to get the horses. Yeah, I think I'm going to take. Take him and forward settle him. He's not going to like this, but I want those horses. I want horses. I mean, we have those war chariots. And two coppers. I think one horse and one copper will, will make them. So we're going to we're gonna do something we shouldn't do, but we're going to try to do it. Let's, let's have some fun. There's more copper up here. Yes. Okay. These guys are in a hot, the hot place. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, I have a proposal for you. Um. Give me a moment to think, friend. I accept. Please to accept your proposal, friend. This is good. That's good, yes. Let's eat grog. Let's eat let's have some wine. Do you guys drink wine? He looks like he drinks wine. He looks like Kevin. That's an inside joke. Okay. A hunting we will go, a hunting we will go. Okay, I think uh, that's fine. Doesn't really matter with this. No fear. Ooh, we got him. Hunt it nasty. Okay. We could go down here. I guess we will do that. What do we got here? Another 
Lead, okay. I'll push right here. Twelve ten. Nerve the wrong man. Whoops. That's okay. We gotta get the outpost. Where's a good outpost here? Eleven five. Eleven five. Five eight. Twelve six. 11, 5, 12, 6, 10, 5, 11, 3, 2, 6, 11, 12, 12, 6. I guess we'll do it here. Six seven, seven eight, six eleven. Since we got more food. Twelve six. We'll go there. Find this one. We're gonna be in wars with San Lorenzo. We're blocking him off anyway. Fourteen, thirteen, open the treat. We don't want to fight with anybody because we don't have the band power over here right now. So let us get our outposts. We could do this. We could get the horses and then get the copper here first. And then fight our way back. We may have to fight our way back. And then we have salt here, which is nice to have. Let's see if there's a good place for a city or an outpost here. Where am I? Let's see. 24, 18, 6. 24, 14, 6. I like 24, 18, 6. 17, 6. 18, 6. I think we'll do that. 18, 6. That's 18 food. Yeah. Could go on the hunt here. Okay, two. We have two here. More copper over here. Follow me. Some silk. Some salt. Hmm.
Keep fighting. What's going on here? I think he's trying to. Uh, we have to try to fight, I guess. Battle way up in the hills. All right, I should have defensive position here. So end rounds. Yeah, I got defensive on the high ground big time. Just slaughter him. Okay. Victory at Aura Up. Twelve, six, ten, eleven, nine. That's pretty close. Maybe eleven, nine would be a nice place because then we can get more food. Let me see. Maybe eleven, nine will work with and be in here in this cove. The instead of right on the mountain, right on the river. Give me more. Okay. Follow me. Mm -hmm. Wow. It's all deep mountains. Let's go over here. This way. Understood. Manual battle. He's trying to take this spot and I can't let him have it. End deployment. Let's go. Okay. I'll bring some reinforcements over to the other side over there. 
make sure we get our things up because we need to settle soon. Let's see, I'll post. Can I settle? Two eleven, five ten. Two eight, two six. Why can't I uh, settle here? I don't understand this. Oh, because it's too close to this. We already settled on Stula here. Wait a minute. Seven turns. How much food is here? Should be a. It's got five on there, so that should be enough. Seven turns to settle. This has got the copper. And another resource. It'll connect with that place. And turn. Okay, we have... Open battle. I thought this guy was, he wasn't healed. Now all of a sudden he's healed up. That's kind of bunk. All right. Yeah. We're going to be defeated here. Automatic battle on. Yeah. We lost that one. Oh, we had a victory. How did we get a victory? Oh, we're doing that one. Okay, get over here. 11-9. We want to go right there. Let's get over there. Follow me. Yeah, we need some reinforcements. This guy up here. Over this way. Over this way. This will give us the horses. Yeah. We're way behind here. Come over here. Let's go. I wonder if we can heal next to an outpost. The Assyrians. The fact that they have horses and siege engines might indicate their preferences as a neighbor. Okay, what we're going to do... Okay, we got that place next to San Lorenzo, which we'll have to take at some point.
charge. We'll fight this guy. Where is he? <clears throat> Off we go. <laughs> Massacred. Victory. Society. Knowledge. The calendar first. Okay. Curiosity collected. So we have that, and then we have this place. Horse and horse and copper. And I think I'm gonna make a break here. I'm gonna end this turn and we'll make a break. More horses up here. Yeah. These are Assyrians, eh? Okay, there's this lady. I'm a good neighbor and a loyal friend. As long as you don't cross me. Extrovert, that's hateful. All right, we won't do anything to her. Maybe we should, though, just in case. Get rid of some of our troops in through here. All together. We'll attack. Let's see. This is. I'm gonna leave you stationed here because we're gonna we're gonna put another uh, outpost there for that copper. I don't know what our if we need uh, what we need there. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I think we need one copper, one horse. In deployment. Right. Okay, and round, we'll let them come down. We'll attack once here. Come over here. Uh-huh. Let's go. Okay. And round. Victory at the Battle of Kujam. Okay. Well, we got two horses up here. Look at this. One in this area, one in this area. We can make a huge empire here. But we're going to cut this part right now. And uh, thanks, everybody, for watching. We've had some battles here. We're really close to the uh, San Lorenzo here. So they may have some trouble with us uh, later. But we'll see what happens. Thanks for watching, everybody.